Tyler from Aspire Sports, and we have some news regarding Dalvin Cook and the whole situation. Uh, what I'm going to do is, I know I'm late to this, but I'm going to give my thoughts on the whole situation in terms of just purely fantasy football. I'm not going to talk about the real life aspect. I'm just going to talk about fantasy football. I've received a bunch of questions, what to do with Dalvin Cook. So after reading stuff um, and just kind of having you know my thought process, what the NFL has done throughout the years, I'm going to give my own uh, take on the situation. So if you enjoy this content, make sure you hit that like button for me. Uh, subscribe to the channel and make new content like this every single day. And let's get into the video. So in terms of what to do with Dalvin Cook, and once again, this is all my personal opinion. This is not, I'm not, you know, a lawyer or anything like this. Uh, this is no legal advice. This is strictly 100% my opinion. All right. What I would do with Dalvin Cook is I would hold on to him. And the reason being is if we look at what's going on with Deshaun Watson, he has all these civil lawsuits against him. Uh, currently, he is not in trouble with the NFL. Um, and he's not playing right now because he doesn't want to play for the Houston Texans. It's not that he's not playing because the NFL, you know, is is making him not play. He just does not want to play for the Houston Texans. He wants to be traded. Uh, the Houston Texans wanted to trade him, so that's also part of why he's not playing as well. But the big thing is Deshaun Watson does not want to play for the Houston Texans. That's why he's not playing. So this is currently a civil lawsuit against. Dalvin Cook. And usually the NFL, just historically, really in everything that they do, they are pretty slow at getting to this stuff and letting it play out in court before they actually step in and do something. Now, what a team does, what teams have done in the past is different than what the NFL does. And teams are are able to do what they think is best for their team. But as, as of right now, I don't anticipate the NFL doing anything with Dalvin Cook until this plays out, which could very well be into next year. So I would hold on to Dalvin Cook now if you're worried about Dalvin Cook. If you're worried about him, worried about trading him, the best thing I should I would recommend, and it's really hard, like I know I'm going to get some questions like this in the in the comments, but who do I trade Dalvin Cook for? What I would do is I would go to a team that needs a running back and just start sending out trade offers, start communicating with that team. Maybe they don't even want Dalvin Cook because they're worried about the situation as well. Uh, but I would definitely, that's what I would do if you want to trade away Dalvin Cook. But me personally, I would just hold on to Dalvin Cook. I don't think anything happens with the NFL. Now, maybe the new new information comes out here in the coming days, coming weeks that could definitely affect Dalvin Cook um, and really make the NFL step in or specifically the Minnesota Vikings step in and do something. But as of right now, with the current situation, with the current information out there, I don't think the NFL steps in and does something right now. I think it continues to play. So once again, 100% my opinion on it, uh, what I've read, uh, what I think is completely my my opinion on it. So agree with me down in the comments. Let me know what you think. Um, let's have a discussion. So with that being said, if you enjoy the content, make sure you hit that like button. Also subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching and have a great day.